The friends and family are holding a celebration of life tonight for Jackson Christman of St. Pete Beach. The 28 year old was reported missing on Saturday and investigators found his body in the water on St. Pete Beach Sunday. Deputies say he was in a boating accident today. 10 Tampa Bay's Megan Myers spoke to two of his best friends about how they're remembering him. Saturday afternoon, I knew that nobody had heard from him in a while. Jackson Christman took his boat out on Friday afternoon. His friend Dalton Dunham says Jackson spent most of his time out on the water. The kid had salt water in his veins. His family members and friends were out trying to find him. One friend ended up finding his boat washed up on the beach. When he found that and found there was damage uh, on the boat, um, that through a lot of us into worst case scenario. Investigators believe he hit a pylon, throwing him from his boat. Then they believe he hit his head on another pylon. It was the last person you would ever thought that would have happened to. His best friend, Ryan Hodge, says anytime he thinks of the water or the beach, he thinks of Jackson. If he wasn't working on the water, he wanted to be on the water. And now he will think of all of their memories together. Uh, Jackson was a uh, childhood best friend, uh, you know, would have been uh, like my best man at my wedding. The 28 year olds loved ones say he was the easiest person to get along with. Jackson was the, you know, the bright light on a dark day. Tonight, his friends and family will be holding a celebration of life for him. He would want everyone to be happy. He would want everyone to remember what he tried to instill in everyone and that's just that this this place is a beautiful place. Megan Myers, 10 Tampa Bay. And the celebration of life is happening tonight from 6 to 10 at the Toasted Monkey in St. Pete Beach.